do it. You scrawled on this video to do it. It's your boy, Daddy Scobar Dreamer. Alright y'all, we back with another big body banger, you feel me? Listen, today we have something a little different. Apparently this nurse, right? We all know nurses, you know what I'm saying? Nurses, they help you with your medicine. You go to the hospital, they, they give you your IV, they rub your back. Are you okay? You know what I'm saying? You, you need the doctor. This one has a side gig though. This nurse right here has a side gig. And the side gig is not singing praise and worship at church. It's not Chick-fil-A. It's not working at a restaurant. She has a bona fide only fans. You know what I'm saying? She has a successful only fans account, subscription, video, playlist, whatever the heck it's called. You know what I'm saying? She does only fans on the side. And apparently she's making the big bucks. You know what I'm saying? But she's also a nurse. I don't know why she's still a nurse if she's making big bucks on, on only fans. But apparently, right, at work, she found her coworkers. Watching her OnlyFans. Now, that's weird. You know what I'm saying? It's different. Okay, it's it's different, you know what I'm saying, when you making the content of OnlyFans for, like, random people on the internet. You're not really concerned about random people on the internet grabbing that lotion and that napkin and doing what they have to do. You're not really concerned about that. But then when it's realistic and you see real people, your co-workers, the people you go to work with, watching your stuff, and then you see them go in the bathroom for an extended bathroom break. <laughs> Yeah, it's weird. Super, super weird. You know what I'm saying? So apparently this show they found out about that. Or she found out that her co-workers were watching the uh the videos or whatever. And I'm not sure exactly what happens. I just know that's that, that that's what happened. I don't know if she got fired for it or I don't know if she the dudes approached her and wanted to make a video. You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't I don't I'm not exactly sure what happened. But if you want to watch this, I'm very excited. If you're excited to smash the like button, subscribe if you're not subscribed already, and hit the post notification bell so you can be notified whenever I drop these bangers. You know what I'm saying? Cops of a Drew Rack too. You can buy two and third free bell up six seven fifty dollars. I'm about to restock a lot of stuff on there. I think a lot of stuff is sold out, so I'm about to restock it soon. So um definitely stay tuned for that. Um but yeah we're gonna hop right into this. You ready? Let go. So, before I start, okay, there might be some new people here. If nope. you're new, I we all know my main income is OF. I'm in the adult industry. Okay. Well, I work a PRN job in nursing homes in four different nursing homes in the tri-state area. They will text me like, "Hey, do you want to work? Can you work?" And I'll be like, "Yes or no." Okay. Been doing this for over a year and a half at these same four nursing homes. Well, I get a text from one of them yesterday asking if I want to work today. And I was like, I had plans, but if you're really that low staffed, yes, I will come in, of course. So she's a, I'm, she's a um, part-time nurse because she's making the most money on her only fan, the OF. She's making most fan on the OF, you know what I'm saying? I should say the OF. So she's, she's making most of her money on, oh, she got a kid too. We see the car seat in the back. Okay. Okay, she's doing something. Of course I will. Um... So, I don't know whether to laugh or cry right now. Um, I clock in. Okay, I clock in. And this lady I've never seen before, she was like, are you Jalen? And I was like, yeah. And she was like, you need to come to my office. I was like, okay. And I thought for sure it was going to be like a COVID test or something along those lines. Oh, no. She, right when I, she closed the door. I walked in, she closed the door, and she was like, I got to let you go. And I was like... Like, I was waiting for her to tell me why she was letting me go. Like, she didn't say anything. So, I was like, for what? Like, why are you letting me go? And she said, it came to my attention of what your main income is and what you do online and how you're this big social media person. At that moment, I was already realized. I was like, here we fucking go. Okay? So... She's but honestly, you got to think about it, right? I think we talked about this before. Um, like when I made a reaction video to that to the teacher that got the whole, the her body done and all that like whatever she just whatever you know what I'm saying? she got her body done and all that you gotta think about it that's 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 it's I I don't know if it's weird but it's like that's like a a, a prostitute that works at your child's daycare you know what I'm saying like it's just like you don't really she's a prostitute but she's also a daycare worker. So she's working at the daycare, watching over your kids, 
but she's eating other people's kids. You know what I'm saying? It's it's it's, it's weird. Even though you could of course be that that daycare worker in this time frame between ten to three, you daycare. But then six to one o'clock in the morning, you was getting clapped. So it's 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 kind of like the same thing, I guess. Kinda. That might be a little extreme example, but it's kind of like the same thing. It's the same thing, low key. Low key. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. Let me know in the comments. You said I knew about your occupation a couple months ago, but you weren't really that big, so it wasn't really a big deal to me, and I can't really fire somebody for doing yeah, what Yeah, they, can't, they can't fire her for that, actually. Then I'm thinking, what, how, that's discrimination, ain't it? Ain't that like a legal thing that's like discrimination? They can't do that or something? I feel like they can't do that. And basically is what she said. Her words. I can't fire somebody for doing what you do. Then she proceeded to say that you know, it, like, it wasn't a big deal a couple months ago when she found out because no one was talking about it. Well, I guess every time that I've been working lately, that the CNAs and the nurses have been talking about me at the nurse station while I'm in a patient's room. Okay, well, I am always doing care on somebody. They're at the nurse station looking at my Instagram, looking at my Twitter, looking at my site. Like, they paid for my site so they all could see and look at the nurse station while... Listen, your haters is paying your bills. You have to be happy. At the end of the day, your hater. There's a, somebody that hates me watching this video right now. You probably already watched three ads. Thank you, hater. I hate you too. <laughs> but my bank account doesn't, baby. While they're on the clock, okay? And she said that she can't have that happening every time that I work. So she has to let me go. That didn't even like, make sense. Girl, did you just hear yourself? These women are literally taking your time that you pay oh, them for. Oh, so it's girls that's that's doing it. Oh, they just haters. I thought it was dudes that was watching and just taking extended lunch breaks. I thought that's what it was. I thought that's why she would have got fired for it. I, anything was just like some hating little girls, you know what I'm saying? Girls is the biggest haters of girls. I don't know why I don't know why girls be talking about dudes I always hate girls, dudes hate girls or whatever. Girls are the biggest haters of girls. Like Period. And I don't know why I think it's like it's a territorial thing or it's like a, I don't know what it is, but girl, like literally think about it right now. Girls hate on girls way more than dudes hate on girls. Girls hate on girls way more than dudes hate on guys. Dudes don't hate on guys. We don't care. You know, we don't really talk about people like that. Girls will talk about girls and then, and they'll talk about guys, but girls are the biggest haters of girls. And I don't know why that is, but that's just what it is. But um, yeah, I thought it was gonna be like dudes that's watching it and then like a patient Wondering what's taking so long because they dying on the floor, but the dudes is <laughs> the dudes is <laughs> shooting something on the floor. You know what I'm saying? Like, girl, did you just hear yourself? These women are literally taking your time that you pay them for, sitting at the nurse station, buying my stuff, looking at my socials while I'm in a room doing care, but I'm the problem and I get let go. That don't make sense. Okay. It's weird. Oh, but this is what she said. Her main reason for letting me go is because they need a job more than I do. Eh, I guess that uh, low key that kind of makes sense a little bit. They do need the job more than you, but if they, it's still not. That's still not a legit reason to fire somebody. Like she said in the beginning, she can't fire her for that. You know what I'm saying? So I'm confused how all of a sudden she can now fire her for that. She should have lied and said, "I'm gonna fire you because." One of the patients got an infestation of lice from you or something, something weird. I don't know. She should have made something up. She should not have said, uh, I see you having OnlyFans and you be shaking that thing on the Internet. So I have to let you go. Like, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. But like I said before, it's kind of like that whole thing. Would you want your kid's teacher to also have an OnlyFans? Like, it's, it's weird. Would you want your, day, your kid's daycare person to be like... A stripper you know what i'm saying like it's just like uh it's okay it's okay it's like it's like a, a would you want would you hire a construction worker who's a hitman on the side like would you would you like it's just like you could have two different jobs but when one is like out the way you know what i'm saying then it's like ah i don't know if i need you here boss you know what i'm saying Y'all let me know. Maybe I'm doing some extreme examples. But y'all let me know in the comments down below. 
so I know some little freaky dicky little boy just said, I would love for my my kids teaching to be OnlyFans star. I would go to every parent teacher conference. I know some little freaky little weirdo kids said that in the comments. Watch yourself. Be better. You're nasty. Anyways, man, that's the end of the video. I'ma see y'all. Out. Hey yo, C3, so fly, hop out the butterfly. Wings to the sky, no, I'm never borderline. They choose I, cause I'm way above you. The waves make the haters love you when the ladies come through.